Hey guys, we're going to go ahead and take a look at some more scale factor, but now we're going to take a look at when our scale factor is a factor that's less than 1. So I kind of want you to think about what might happen when the scale factor is less than 1. In our last video, when the scale factor was 2, we saw our shape double in size. Well, what do you think might happen when the scale factor is less than 1? Let's go ahead and take a look. So we have an 8 by 12 rectangle, and we want to go ahead and use our scale factor of 1 fourth. Let's see what happens to the sides. So I'm going to go ahead and start with our 8 unit side and multiply it by 1 fourth. Remember, whole numbers, go ahead and place it over 1. We could do some cross canceling. Our 4 will become a 1. Our 8 will become a 2. 2 times 1 is 2. 1 times 1 is 1. So our 8 unit side is now only a 2 unit side when we had a scale factor of 1 fourth. Let's go ahead and take a look at our 12 unit side. 12 over 1 times 1 fourth. 4 goes into 4 once, goes into 12 3 times. We get 3 over 1, which is just 3. So our 8 unit side ended up scaling down to just 2 units. Our 12 unit side ended up scaling down to 3 units. So now let's go ahead and draw the new figure. So I'm going to take my 8 unit side that used to be 8 units, and now it's only 2. And my 12 unit side, when it was scaled with a scale factor of 1 fourth, is now 3. a much smaller rectangle is formed. That's because we literally took one-fourth or we divided each side by four.